Hi everyone and welcome back. It's been a while. Um, it has been a while, to be fair. Um, and I just want to make this video, and I know at the end of the video, someone's going to comment and say, Steve, you don't need to explain yourself, mate, as long as you're okay, it's all that matters. And for that, I, I, I do appreciate that, and I thank you for that, guys. And, um, but I just thought I'd make this video, um, just to sort of let you know what's going on, where I've been, what's happening in the future. Now, firstly, two things, there's two things, right, that I've had to deal with. One's my health. It got to a stage where I was eating so much junk food and so much rubbish all the time, every day to make these videos. I wasn't watching what I was doing and I was just going and I was just eating far too much crap and it made me ill, basically. Um, cut a long story short, it's made me ill. Now, went to the doctors, they done all these tests and one thing and another and um, all the results were coming in and every, every result of every test or scan or x-ray or whatever they had done, every single result that came back wasn't good. For example, high cholesterol, very high cholesterol, high blood pressure, and yeah, everything, it's just that everything was coming back bad, and um, yeah, I, it, it was making me ill. I was lethargic, I had no interest in anything, I'd become, uh, it, it just wasn't great, it just, it made me ill, okay? Now, Another deciding factor. The second thing, and it's been a mixture of these two things, the second thing is where I'm living. Isn't good. Isn't good. Um, area's fine. Neighbours are fine. The actual building itself is a shambles. In my opinion, it needs put it down. It really does. Um, but, as a lot of people know, Getting, getting the landlord to do anything, which is the Housing Association, um, is an absolute nightmare. Absolute nightmare. Um, it's, it's... I've basically been living with um, damp and mould, and I don't mean just little bits, it's been horrendous. Now, um, yeah, just, I've, I've been here about a year and a half, maybe two years, I can't, I'm not sure off the top of my head. But every day, since I've been here, I've been breathing that in, and it hasn't been great. And you can only go so far as the cleaning it off, it does your head in. And I guess you become sort of nose blind to it, and you think it's okay, but really it isn't. And yeah, I've been breathing that in, so that's been making me bad as well. To a degree where I've had to go to the doctors again and get inhalers for, to, for my breathing. It's been affecting my lungs. I couldn't go from one room to the other. I've got shops opposite where I live, and I couldn't go to the shops without getting out of breath and having to stop. It became that bad. So a mixture of that and my eating habits and my diet and my poor health wasn't great, so I had to take a break and sort this stuff out. And that's what I've done, and that's where I've been. But, good news is, I have been sorting my health out. I have been sorting my diet out, hence the break from the food reviews. And I'm no longer living here. And that's because, I'm now living here. Yes, I have moved. Oh, yes. Results. Finally, I've moved. I'm out of there. I'm in here. Nice new place. Nice and clean. Fresh, bright, and so much better. And already, I've only, I'm only just moving in. Literally. Boxes everywhere need to be unpacked. But it's made such a difference, I am so much happier, it's unreal, and already I love the place, absolutely love it. I'm still in Bristol, not far from where I was, but far enough, and I, I just, I love it, already love the place. Right, now, so to address the issues I had, my health is a lot better, um, everything's getting back to normal-ish, 
um, everything's getting back to where it should be. I'm feeling better in myself, feeling more positive. Um, and I'm just going to keep on doing what I'm doing now, um, which is, you know, watching what I eat. Like I've cut, I've cut all the junk food out, well, not completely, but a hell of a lot. Uh, I am eating sort of a lot better and, and feeling much, much better. Um, I'm actually sleeping better as well, which is great because I wasn't sleeping before. And the second issue, housing sorted, done. And oh, I love it. Honestly, I can't tell you how much a difference it has made. Right, so. What, what is happening now? Is this the end for Steve Eats? I've made a decision. Ding. And the decision is, um, is it the end of Steve Eats? Unfortunately, yes it is. I have decided there is no more Steve Eats. Steve Eats food reviews is done. However, I am still going to be uploading videos. Um, there is going to be a complete new concept for the channel. I'm going to rebrand the channel. I'm going to call it something different and do something different. I've no idea what to call it. Any suggestions and your help would be appreciated. Um, got any ideas, send them my way. What am I going to be doing in the future? Well, I've still got my van. I'm still converting my van. So I've got some more videos of those to be posting up. Um, and when it's done, I will be doing things like, you know, going out places in it. Um, so there'll be, um, I don't know, videos on any days out that I might do. If I go camping on a campsite, um, there'll be videos on that. If I go on holiday, there'll be videos. Um, a bit of stealth camping maybe, you know, be videos on that as well. And if, if I am out and about and I do eat out somewhere, yeah, I'll give it a food review, why not? I'll chuck that in as well. Also, I want to do things like, if a topic comes up that gets on my nerves, if it grinds my gears, I'm going to do a video on it. If it's something that I'm out and about and I think, oh, that's unusual, I'll do a video. Just a bit of everything. I don't want to. I don't want to get into the habit of eating all that food again because I don't want to go back. No, 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 no. Don't want to go back there at all. So the, the channel's going to be completely different. A whole new range of things. Anything and everything. Um, but I've got to get myself settled in here. I've got to get things unpacked, um, sorted out, and um, all the necessaries done. So it's going to take me a couple of weeks to sort things out here and then I've got to sort the channel out and rebrand everything and change everything and then I will be back. But I just thought I'd let you know where I've been, what I've been doing and what's happening in the future. Now someone has said to me, if you do that you're going to lose subscribers. Guys, if I lose subscribers, I've, I've, I'm not going to say I don't care because I do, um, but I've got to put me and my health first. Um, and I don't want to go back to where the way I was feeling. Not a chance. So if I lose subscribers and you're only here for the food reviews, then I thank you. Um, and I get it. It's fine. However, if you want to stick around, you want to show me videos, you want to get people here, great, that's fantastic, and I love you for it. But yeah, that's where I am, that's what I'm doing. So like I say, as soon as I'm sorted here, sorting things out, give me a couple of weeks, and then I've got to rebrand all the channel and everything, and come up with a name, and God knows what else. But that's where I am. Guys, thank you very much. I've got to crack on, loads to do, but it's so much better. Guys, I love you loads, love you loads. And I will see you very soon. I'm not going to say, I can't say when because I don't know, I've got to get sorted. But guys, thank you for watching, take care, and I will see you in the next video.